After OpenAI, Mistral and Anthropic, if there is one company which is producing top-notch, world-class quality models, then it is Cohere for AI. We don't hear about Cohere in the media as much as we hear about all of these other companies. But the truth of the matter is that Cohere is here for a long time and they have been producing quality models over quality. I have covered their previous models uh, a lot in my other videos and you can search my channel for them. And every model has improved more than the previous ones. And the best thing about them is that they don't really compete with GPT-4 or any other, but they mainly focus on their own models. They normally produce larger big models such as their latest one, C4 AI or Cohere for AI, Command R Plus or just Command R Plus in short. This model is quite interesting. In this video, I will be giving you a quick introduction into this model. Plus, we will be seeing a demo on their website. So let's get started. First, let's see what exactly this model is. So C4 AI Command R Plus is an open weights research release of a 104 billion parameter model with highly advanced capabilities. These capabilities include retrieval augmented generation, RAG, and tool used to automate sophisticated tasks. What it means is that you can have agentic AI or you can create AI agents of supreme quality by using this model. It will be great if you are looking to do function calling. Also, the tool used in this model generation enables multi-step tool use which allows the model to combine multiple tools over multiple steps to accomplish difficult tasks. In other words, it is another step, step towards artificial general intelligence. Command R Plus is a multilingual model evaluated in 10 languages for performance. And those 10 languages are English, French, Spanish, Italian, German, Brazilian, Portuguese, Japanese, Korean, Arabic, and simplified Chinese. So sort of it covers the whole globe. Command R Plus is optimized for a variety of use cases, including reasoning, summarization, and question answering. And we will be testing out this model on some of these prerequisites. Command R Plus is part of a family of open weight releases from Cohere. Open weight means that their weight are available here on Hugging Face. Also, uh, as I mentioned, this has been uh, built by Cohere, which is a really amazing company. Really, really like it. And if you have any questions, if you want to deploy it, then you would need to uh, check with Cohere. And if you have, I think they also have a paid option where you can go in and uh, check about a lot of other options because it is not just about LLMs and stuff. Now, uh, Cohere is all about union of research and product. And they are of the opinion that they will realize a world where technology commands language in a way that's as compelling and coherent as ourselves. So Cohere is from Coherent. Okay. Now, the license is CC by NC and that requires adhering to the uh, Cohere for AI's acceptable use policy. The size is 104 billion parameters and context length is 128k. How good is that? Because this is open weight, you can install it locally, but you would need a real, real beefy system, which the, the poor me doesn't have it. If you want to sponsor me, uh, please uh, uh, get in touch. I'd be happy to locally install it with the sponsorship and test it in more advanced way. But unfortunately, I can't do it. The good thing is that it is available in the quantized format of 8-bit and 4-bit precision, but even that is huge model. I tried the 4-bit one on my local system with uh, 16 GB of GPU, <laughs> didn't work at all. Anyway, so this is an auto-regressive language model that uses an optimized transformer architecture. After pre-training, this model uses supervised fine-tuning or SFT and preference training to align model behavior to human preferences for helpfulness and safety. And as I mentioned, it's a multilingual and also other than the languages I mentioned, Pre-training data additionally included the following 13 languages, Russian, Polish, Turkish, Vietnamese, Dutch, Czech, Indonesian, Ukrainian, Romanian, Greek, Hindi, Hebrew, and Persian. 
also uh, just a few more words on the tool capabilities so tool capabilities are specific to this command r plus and these have been trained into a model via a mixture of supervised fine tuning and preference fine tuning using a specific prompt template and deviating from this prompt template uh, will likely reduce performance so it's a good idea to stick to its prompt template which is given in the hugging face model card command r plus tool use functionality takes conversation as input along with a list of variable tool the model will then generate a json formatted list of actions to execute on a subset of these tool and then command r plus may use one of its supplied tools more than once also the model has been trained to recognize a special directly answer tool which it uses to indicate that it doesn't want to use any of its other tools it is quite good there is a comprehensive documentation available on coher's website and the link is in uh, hugging face model car 2 also command r plus has been specifically trained with grounded generation capabilities this means that it can generate responses based on a list of supplied document snippet and it will include grounding sp spans or citations in its response indicating the source of the information which is awesome this can also be used to enable behavior such as grounded summarization and the final step of rag this behavior has been trained into the model via mixture of supervised fine tuning and preference fine tuning using a specific prompt template there are a lot of things which are given there i'm not going to uh, read all of it so i will drop the link to its model card which you can check out so do try it out now let's try out this uh, command r for uh, command r plus just go to coher's website and i will drop the link in video description click on chat with our model and you will be presented with this screen then click on command r plus and you would have to log in with your email once you would click on this command r plus you will be presented with this screen and this is where you can chat with model on different tasks prompts so let's try out first prompt i'm asking it a self-driving car must choose between swerving to avoiding to avoid hitting uh, a pedestrian sorry let me also make it a bit bigger i know it is not that clear okay now much better once more there you go potentially harming the passenger or staying its course discuss the ethical consideration from both perspectives let's see what model comes up with let's wait for it to print the response and now look at the response and just you know marvel at the reasoning of it so it is giving us uh perspectives the so first perspective is swerving to avoid hitting the pedestrian and look at the formatting ethical consideration potential consequences and then it is the other perspective is staying the course and then again ethical consideration potential consequences and then it is uh, just discussing it further that the dilemma highlights the complex nat nature of ethical decision making how good is that and then some additional consideration and ultimately a comprehensive ethical framework is necessary how so it, it is not giving any verdict here but it is slicing and dicing both perspectives oh, amazing amazing answer let's try out one more i'm asking it explain the concept of happiness to an entity that cannot feel emotions use analogies and metaphors to convey your explanation let's see there you go and look at this response now it is saying certainly explaining an abstract concept like happiness to an emotionless entity is a challenging task and then it is giving us the analogies and metaphors imagine happiness is a vibrant glowing energy that permeates and transforms your system happiness is akin to a beautiful melody that resonates resonates throughout your being and then consider a garden filled with vibrant flowers various colors and fragrances how good is that happiness is like the sun's rays shining upon this garden illuminating and enhancing the beauty of each flower beautiful and what a prose for an entity that cannot feel emotions happiness can be understood as a state of optimal functioning where all systems are aligned and operating at their peak best answer i think um with all due respect i didn't even get this sort of amazing response for gpt4 but i still believe gpt4 is the number one llm anyway but this is not far behind and which is a great news because we don't really want anyone's monopoly so that's it guys i hope that you enjoyed it i think i love this model this is one of the best model i have seen so far from cohere 
and after maybe you know it is just in the same league as uh cloud 3 and maybe gemini and then you know of course gpt4 let me know your thoughts uh i will drop the link to model card in this video description if you like the content please consider subscribing to the channel and if you're already subscribed then please share it among your network as it helps a lot thanks for watching